Today, we're going to take an inside look at how our Live Valve X2 shocks work and how they optimize comfort and stability in all situations. Live Valve X2 shocks are highly sophisticated. They have two electronic adjusters, one that controls compression and one that controls rebound and each adjuster is independently controlled by the semi-active Polaris Dynamics dual valve system. A semi-active suspension system has three main aspects. First, sensors gather real-time data every few thousandths of a second. Then, this data is interpreted by an algorithm that determines the optimal setting for each shock. And last, each shock is automatically adjusted multiple times per second. Now, beyond being semi-active, what makes these shocks special are the unique oil flow paths for both compression and rebound. This means each adjustment is truly independent and does not affect the other. For example, in the same moment the system can increase compression while decreasing rebound to maintain better support, traction, and comfort. As the shock compresses, oil flows simultaneously through two paths. Oil goes through the first path as the main piston pumps it up through the inner body and pushes it through the internal bypass ports. Then, the oil flows between the inner and outer body and back around into the refill holes at the base of the shock. Side note. This circular flow, which is controlled by the internal bypass shims, provides comfort over aggressive terrain and support from bottoming out when the main piston passes the internal bypass ports. At the same time oil flows through the first path, it also flows through a second path, through the compression live valve X2 adjuster and into the reservoir. As the shock rebounds, the oil also flows simultaneously through two paths. Oil goes through the first path as the main piston moves down the shock body. As the oil leaves the reservoir, it flows through a one-way check valve that leads back into the top of the inner shock body. At the same time oil flows through the first path, oil at the base of the shock starts flowing through the second path by moving back through the refill holes. The oil continues to flow up and moves through the rebound live valve X2 adjuster and then into the top of the inner shock body. While the unique oil flow makes compression and rebound work independently, it's the intelligence behind Dynamics DV and live valve X2 that calibrates each shock separately on the fly. During compression and rebound, each live valve X2 adjuster controls how fast or slow the shock moves. For the shock to move faster, it decreases preload on the spring behind the needle, which provides more comfort. For the shock to move slower, it increases preload on the spring behind the needle, which provides more support. If the terrain becomes even more aggressive, these adjustments to the needle work in tandem with the boost valve which uses hydraulic pressure to progressively increase support and protect you from bottoming out. Thanks for taking the time to join us today for an inside look into how Live Valve X2 shocks work and how they pair with Dynamics DV to independently adjust each shock, giving you comfort and control at all times. If you'd like to see more videos like this one, you can click subscribe, follow us on social media, or join us on the web at foxacademy.ridefox.com.